Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. We have all the action for you live on EA TV. It is a stadium that has a feel very much of its own. I'm talking, of course, of Craven Cottage. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Fulham, and they face Brentford. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession. And in with a real chance. There it is! The first goal in the derby. A special moment. Well, here it is again. And it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. Christian Nurgard, Janert, Jurgensen with it. And they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. But really sticking to their task defensively. Well, technically offside, but not by a lot. Bobby Reid. Good tackle. Showing patience as well as persistence in the build-up. And the keeper making sure there were no scraps for them to feed on. Palinha. Pereira. How can he take them on and beat them? Well, there's a textbook example of how to press the ball. Perfectly positioned to take it away. Jensen, Roroslev, oh that's a well-timed pass, on the ball Jensen, nicely timed tackle, Kenny Tete, Reid now, bodies forward and the break looks on, well, an example of a counter-attack that went nowhere. Well, visionary passing. The end product just wasn't there. Jensen. And a Brentford throw in. Pinnock. On to me. Henry, Vitali Janelt, had a chance to whip it in here, this could be the equaliser, but oh, what an important save, how about that? Well, at least he hit the target, but he should really beat the keeper from there, they should be level now.
And he's fired over the corner. And still dangerous. Oh, heading it narrowly over the top. Bobby Reid and Palinho with it well read to put an end to that attack Christian Nurgard the referees letting it go as they keep the ball and a timely intervention Pereira Reid surely off the post well no damage done great pressure to win the ball back this might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity well, totaling up all the stoppages we'll have two additional minutes a wonderful intervention And there we have it, we've reached the half. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. And good work to deny the chance. He's driven in the corner. Well, the danger is still there. Pinnock. Could be troublesome. Wonderful chance, and a goal! Real excitement here, the equaliser. Well, as you can see, what an excellent back heel this is to set up the goal. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. So, a level contest, 1-1. Bobby Reid. Sloppy in possession from Fulham. No foul play, says the referee. A decisive clearance it was. Now can they counter clinically? They need to get bodies back. Christian Nurgard. Mbermo. Just the challenge that was required. Can they trouble the opposition this time? There's a slide draw pass. Well, it looked like a good ball, but cut out in the end. Now, who can he play it to? A good and fair challenge. Tim Ream. 20 minutes remaining. Pereira. Well, spot on with that challenge. 
sound piece of goalkeeping. Tete. A creative look about this. And simply couldn't beat the first defender. Pereira. Mitrovic. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Oh, good vision. Real chance. Oh, good work by the keeper. Substitution for four. Here it is now, a substitution. Going short. And Willian whips it in. Well, I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper, but I was wrong. Only five minutes left for play, and tension galop. He's in behind. And missed time to run, sadly. That's offside. Taking it away. On the offensive, is there to be late excitement? Well, disappointing end to the move. Tony. Wissa has it. Henry. Now he must favour the cross. And a free kick awarded by the referee. Number 10, Tom Kearney. Substitution for Brentford. Coming off the pitch, number 27, Vitaly Janelt. To be replaced by number 10, Josh De Silva. And deep into the penalty area. Can they forge ahead? Josh De Silva. Well, you just never know about chances near the end. You've got to be opportunistic. Will this corner do it? And over it comes. Well, it has come to nothing. And the whistle is sounded, and these two teams...